Yeah, it was under my bedside cabinet. Must have knocked it off while I was sleeping. To think I was going to blame that poor lad. <laughs> yeah, just lucky never reported it. Cheers, Craig. Hey, and thanks for the advice. Just a word of warning, he is not in a good mood. What? All right, all right, I'll see what I can do. Yep, OK. Yeah, I'll speak to you tomorrow. Everything OK? No. The bishop is not happy. And building work is already way over budget. We can't afford the delay while we wait for this new heat pump. I'm sure it's not that bad. Mm. You don't know the bishop. When were you going to tell us? Sorry? You got your ring back. Oh, yeah. Was it all sorted? Yeah, uh, well, no, actually. Um, still a bit loose, but should have tried it on before I left the shop. <laughs> You are too trusting. Maybe. Listen, I've got something that might cheer you up, both of you. Oh? I wanted to try and keep it as a surprise, but um, I've been saving as much as I can from my wages, and this week I hit one grand. Wow, a grand? Really? Yeah, am I really that bad with money? Uh, no, I'm just surprised you'd never mentioned it. Well, it wouldn't have been a surprise then. Look, I know we said we weren't going to do anything big for the honeymoon, but I thought with this, Got no excuse not to. Are you sure? This is your money. No, it's ours. Where are you going to go? Well, you're coming too. What, on your honeymoon? Yeah, I'm not going to be planning the whole day of a lifetime without you. If that's all right. <laughs> of course. No, I can't think of anything better. As long as my room's as far away from yours as possible. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is amazing, Todd. Thank you. No, thank you, both of you. This time last year, I was barely scraping by on my own, and it was awful. I've got my family back, and I'm not going to mess it up this time. You better not. 